Hello everyone, welcome to Sufjan YouTube channel. I'm your Sushma Ma, back again with a new sutra. So here, by using this sutra, you can do your calculation in a fraction of second or very quickly as compared to your conventional math. Yeah. Okay. So here, before going to our start our session, so as you know, this is the tenth episode of the series Secret Strategies of Veda. So first, I will tell you some important points of Suflon. So as you know, Suflon is India's most sincere learning destination for class one to ten. Yes, and here all the classes are hundred percent live and interactive, and to give personal attention for our kids, we have only maximum number of kids in class six. And here, student can ask their doubt without any hesitation. Yes, and a number of time. And we have a dedicated academic team, so those who are tracking on student progress, and as well as they are in continuous touch with parents. If they have any sort of queries, they give the solution. Yeah, conducting PTM, so they have a uh, so many uh, responsibilities. And we are covering your syllabus as per your school exam schedules, as per your preference, and. Also handle the custom request. If you want some extra classes, any revision classes, we also provide the same everything. And during the PTM, we also provide the detailed progress report. And if you enroll with us, even with one subject, you get 4500 plus practice test. Yes, practice test, mock test, so many things. So these are the additional benefit what our student get after enroll with us. Okay. So as you know, this is the episode ten. Yes, and the series secret strategies of Vedas. But before that, let's see what is the motivational line of today's session. So the motivational line is, if in every session, I'm always tell you, uh, what is the trick? Yes. So here. Let's see. So teacher can open the door. Yes, teacher can open the door, but you must enter it yourself. Yes. So I can only teach you the trick, but you have to do practice. Then only you can uh, do that thing very quickly. So here, the main and important thing is practice because practice makes a man perfect. Okay. So today's sutra is the name is little bit difficult. Yeah. Antya, your thus case pi, and you know thus kya, thus thus mean ten. So it's somewhat related to that. And in this session, we are going to see again meaning, application, trick, and examples. Okay, so let's see what's the meaning of antya your thus case pi. Okay, so let's break this one. And tya or the sak pi. What is that? Antya or the sat pi. So the meaning is last totaling ten. Yes, last totaling ten. It's not only ten; it's a power of ten. Okay. So as you can see in application, so the sutra is helpful in multiplying number whose last digit add up to ten or power of ten. It can be hundred, thousand, ten thousand, lakh, anything. So the remaining digit of the number should be identical. So means the starting number should be identical. These should be same. Okay. So let's take example. And let's see how we can do our calculation firstly. Okay, so here suppose I have a number thirty-seven multiplied thirty-three. Thirty-seven multiplied by thirty-three. How we can do this one? By this thirty-three times seven, three times no, 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 no. Direct. See so here, you can see the last digits adding some up to ten, and the starting are identical. Sim, yes, same. So here the same thing. Just remember that one. 25 times 25. The same trick we are going to apply here. Yeah. This I already told you in the previous session. You can go to the playlist. You can watch all the videos. Okay, revise and then come to this one. So 5 times 5 means 25. And number and the next number successor. So what is the successor of 2? That's 3. So 2 times 3 is 6. Answer is six twenty-five. The same thing we are going to apply here. Seven times three is twenty-one. What is the next number of three? That's four. So three times four is twelve, and you got your answer. Same. Yes, but remember one thing. Here we have the two digits. One, two. So the last digit answer come in two digit. If we have 
फोर सो आंसर कम्स इन फोर ओके सो लेट्स टेक वन मोर एग्जाम्पल सपोज आई टेक इट्स वन नाइंटी फाइव टाइम वन हंड्रेड फाइव सो दिस टाइम द सम इज हंड्रेड ओके सो स्टार्टिंग आर आइडेंटिकल एंड द लास्ट इज इट सम हंड्रेड Yes, ninety-five plus five is hundred. So how we are going to do this one? Easy. So number and the next number that one times two is two. But what about this second part? So here, as you can see, ninety-five and five. So I told you about VCM. That is bow tie method. This, 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 this. Yes. So your answer, I'll. can directly write down from the right side also or from the left side also so here i'll tell you how what are this so first one is 0 and then it's 45 yes because it's 9 times 5 times 0 is 0 and 9 times 5 is 45 so 45 plus 0 is 45 and 5 times 5 is 25 so final answer 5 and this 47 and i told you here we have four is it 1 2 3 4 so the second math answer should be in four is it so here i'll write 0 4 7 5 and this is your final answer so instead of multiplying 5 times 5 5 times 9 5 times 1 then 0 times 5 no need to do directly you can apply this vcm and this vcm i explain you in two sessions how you can do your multiplication three digit by three digit four digit by four digit even five digit by five digit how you can make your own patterns yeah so let's do some question practice so it's a practice time so you can pause this video here and then do the practice and see in how much time you do the all the question so 28 times 2 So your last digit sum is ten. So two in the next number two times three is six. Eight times two is sixteen. And your answer. Now this one ten and eleven are identical. So what's the next number of eleven? Eleven times twelve. And that eleven times twelve is one thirty-two. So here we have a technique eleven times twelve. Yeah. So first number and last number, and in the middle we have to write down the sum of this. Okay, and then the last one, six times four is twenty-four. Done. Now this one is the easy one. Nine and the next number that nine times ten is ninety, and in the last twenty-five by five times five is twenty-five. Okay. So now let's see some more example in which the last digit sum up to hundred. Ninety six plus four. Here two are identical. So two times next number that three is six. And for this part, let's multiply this one. Yeah. So ninety six and zero four. So what's the zero? And this one is thirty six and twenty four. Yes. Is that the case? And then what do you have to do? Four eight. Three zero and this is your final answer. Six zero three eight four. I hope this part is clear. Yes. Okay. So now the next one more question here. Four is identical. Eighty seven. So four times five. Four times five is twenty. Yes. Yeah. And now eighty seven and thirty. So eight times one. That eight. Eight times three is twenty-four, and this twenty-four plus seven. Yes, so it's thirty-one, and then twenty-one. Now one. So this one goes here. So thirty-one plus two, thirty-three, and this goes here. Eleven and two zero. So your final answer is two zero double one three one. I hope this part is clear to everyone. Yes. So this is these all are the question. You can take the base as thousand. When you take base as the thousand, so there are the three numbers. So your answer, second bar answer should be of six digit. And this is the end of the session. Thank you, and I hope you like this video. And if you feel this is really helpful for you, so press the like button, comment, and share because बढ़ेगा इंडिया तभी तो बढ़ेगा इंडिया. Don't forget to subscribe our channel. Don't forget to press this bell icon because if you don't want to miss any of the update of any sutra, so press this one. 
and then we will meet in the next session in the next episode with a new sutra so till then bye bye have a good day